Hey there, berries. Welcome to a Thresh game on EU West Diamond 2. Playing with a Kaiser, and we're up against an Alistair Senna. So as you can kind of see with their team compositions, they got like four hard engage and a Senna at the back. Our team is basically five engage, so a lot of engaging. A lot of people are going to be trying to look for fights to. Uh, Get the high ground, basically. Uh, it's going to be a really difficult game. I think 5v5s are going to be an absolute mess. It's just going to be like everything just slapped on top of each other. Crowd control everywhere. Um, I don't know. I don't know how this game's going to play out. So I'm actually really curious. The, the enemy team composition, I like it a lot. I think the weak spot is probably the center though. So if we can get onto that center, it will cut down their damage in team fights by a good margin. Yeah. So I think center has to be the focus early on and honestly probably at the throughout the entire game. If center dies early, it's going to be about half of their damage DPS in the fight down. Hmm, can't really do too much like that. If the Kaiser's gonna play behind me that far, then I don't know what to do. Senna's tanking minions though. Alice is just tanking the hooks there. Second option is to try and room to mid a lot, but... Oh, god. Okay, that's bad. Try and get as many... ...autos out on this Alistair as possible. We can work off this. That's good. I got put in the alcove there, but. Got her coming up in a second. Hmm. Click the lantern, click the lantern. Why are you going in, dude? No. Even in diamond, people don't take the lantern. No, my God. <laughs> okay, at least Alistair got that kill, but what are they doing, dudes? What? I think my team's playing on the moon, because that is some very, very laggy reactions there. I played that perfectly as well. I don't know what to say. I'm not sure what's going on there either. Really, it's trying to deny Zeus. Yes. Can you not push in the wave and just completely deny me like that? Otherwise, I would have walked the mid. Alice is mid. Alice is probably still mid. He might even be the. What is he doing, dude? He's going top. Hecarim's in the river.
yeah. I was gonna say the um We've got a very little map pressure right now. Okay, so uh so it's bloody I'm dead. Wasn't expecting Hecarim to be in that Krug brush. Okay. Okay. Not sure how he got past Vision there then. Did he walk past there? Maybe I didn't see him walk past. Hey Mumble, I hope you get better soon. Hecarim and Alistair are mid. We got the dragon. I need the Kaiser to stop pushing in the wave. Why? Is, yeah, I was gonna say, why are you walking that far up, dude? I can't play with this Kaiser. Uh, she's lagging, apparently. Ugh. Okay, that sucks. Okay, well we have to, we, we just have to let the Kaiser lose lane then I guess, because there's nothing we, else we can do here. What happened to like the turret shots there, so they look invisible? I don't know. Right, we just need Moby Boots and we just need to get out of this lane because this Kaiser is lagging apparently, so we can't do anything with her. We're not going to win the win the game from bot lane. And honestly, I'm letting the Alistair roam way too much. Don't die, don't die, don't die. This is good, 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 this is good. He's gonna die to zombie sign them. I don't like what Kaiser's doing. If she dies, she's gonna die, isn't she? Can't get any charges off them. I don't know. I. I it's Kaiser's annoying me. Just right here. This isn't gonna work. I hate how Senna's got a free lane here.
Kaiser's about to get her ulti. I just hate this because the Kaiser's so far behind, she's losing one for one to Senna, which shouldn't happen actually. That even though Senna can outrange the Kaiser, like Senna shouldn't be able to 1v1 Kaiser in the laning phase just because she is extremely vulnerable, vulnerable to the things. That ghost man, oh my god. Can he? Ekram's running out of mana. Um... It's impossible to play this game. Uh, the map control is just insane. And I have to keep constantly looking at uh, Kaiser. I take Reddick Shield on Thresh because um, Steel Shoulder Guards, like, you're not going to be auto attacking too much anyway. Right, we can help this uh, sign, uh, Renekton, help the sign. Huh. This isn't working. Okay, that's a lot of damage. Uh, can I get out of this? If technically, we did help the sign. <laughs> First turret mid, it's not too bad. Echo ult, a bit weird. Hecarim's gonna be flying in again in a second. It's not worth it. I should have just been happy with the turret. I don't know why they're trying to outplay though. Shelly does get to hit the tier two though. Oh, this is just a really, really difficult game. If the Kaiser wasn't lagging, then this wouldn't be so difficult, actually. Nice. Engaging here at the moment. I feel like they know they have vision, some form of vision around her. Like, literally 80% of the game, I'm just staring at the minimap, just trying to figure out where to go. It's just... Annoying. I need to use these relic show charges. I'm not getting anything here. What is W scale off? Uh, the souls. Q and Alt have AP. I don't discriminate. All must find a 
E scales off um, AD. Plus 100%. But you've also got 100% scaling on the LT for AP and 50% uh, on the Q. Max W this game. I've been maxing W a lot on Thresh recently and I've been enjoying it. Out. I feel like the lanterns have been. Very cool. Okay, well that, okay, whatever. As soon as I pressed it, the hook, I realized I would end up getting the kill then. No one. Have a buff up my KD8 <laughs> or something, I don't know. Um, yeah, I don't like you being there. Can you not be there, please? I don't like this. Can you please click the lantern? Thank you. Hecarim's here. No wards here at all, actually. This is here, no lantern. Honestly, that was best case scenario. Hecarim just running it down like that. Pretty nice. I think there's a bounty there, right? No? no not even a bounty. But yeah, I don't know why the Hecarim did that. I think he thought he could kill me really quickly or something. I don't know what the hell he was doing. Anyway, we need Grievous wins. <clears throat> need a Thorn Melm. Working on it. I love watching you go wild with hooks and lanterns. <laughs> I can imagine in the um, in the Rune Terror lore there'll be some 18 plus film titled titled that hookers and lanterns. Flashing with hookers. There you go. There's your uh, title. I don't like this. I think I'm just going to get him out of this. I don't know. That would have hit the Alistair. Would have gotten away with it as well if it wasn't for these darn minions. Suck, dude. How did I miss that play? Very kindly threw a host over. Hey, we need to get out of here. This Kai's is not very strong right now. We need to just reset because I don't want to be caught out on Baron. That's a lot of souls.
Okay, we're doing alright. We're doing alright. We're getting stuff happening. Renekton's very strong. Echo's very strong. Aurelia. And the Kaiser aren't great, but they can do some things in a fight. Myself, but it's not, nothing to get on the other side of the map. If that hook lands on Senna, she dies. The tower aggro is way too, like the, the build up of damage there is way too big at that point. Get the heck away, dude! Alright, good, good, good. Just. Alright, I need to go heal. I got no mana. Yeah, if that hook landed on Senna, she 100% would have died. The other two walked out of uh, turret range and the turret shots, the, the, the damage was piling up so big, she would have died in like two hits. Yeah, hey, Renex and said, Thresh, you're actually nuts. Zia managed to get onto the other side of the wall. Uh, oh, okay. I swear there was an AD carrier there. But you could say I missed her. <laughs> get it? Senna, the mist. Alright. If I have to explain these jokes, they become a lot less funny a chat, right? Ooh. If I have to explain it, a joke, is a bad joke? No, it's just two five head, man. Click the lantern. Wow! Someone clicked the lantern. Alright. We're still going in. Apparently, apparently we're still going in. Okay. Yeah. Good. There you go. I contributed one lantern. That was a pretty fun game overall, even though it was very stressful. Ah, I'm gonna die to Fountain! <laughs> Guys, I nearly died to Fountain. GG, is that Diamond 1? He said I was cool. He said I was best thrash in the world. That's no, not because we lost the last game before this one. Not diamond one yet on this. Your nuts. Leave my nuts out of it. Alright, GG. 
I think this one's making up to the YouTube. I mean, it's a shame Kaiser lagged. This game would have been much, much easier uh, if Kaiser didn't have internet issues. But it is what it is. It does happen. And honestly, the Renekton and the Echo did a very, very good job. I think I did okay. But the, the, the Alistair made my life very difficult in terms of having to roam around the map, though. Because when you've got an AD carry that is losing 1v1 to the enemy AD carry, it's like you have to then babysit bot lane even more than you need to. So. But anyway, we made it work. If you're watching this on YouTube, then don't forget to subscribe. Of course, more dank content like this. People still say dank, right? If you're watching on Twitch, don't forget to follow and don't forget to stay very awesome.